and click save and here you can see our future slider settings the image new field has been created and here you can create if you want some help text and the permitted image file extensions and so on okay now we just gonna leave it as it is or if you wanna make it as a required field whatever you want okay now I just put it as a default so save and you can see our new image field has been created we need one more field which is link so type link and field name as link and file type here make sure you create selecting link and here automatically selecting as link okay so click save and here also we have created we have lots of options for setting our link field I just gonna put it as it is you can play around with it okay now we have created a new content type and two image I mean one image field and a link field too the next thing we gonna create a image cache preset so go to administrator and go to image cache and now we don't have any preset so we are gonna create a new preset add image create preset so we can give his um, full size image which is um, the real size of the image so we are gonna create um, okay so make sure that here you have to create only sorry for that underscore and so on because it's only for machine readable name so I just gonna give us a full size okay full underscore size and this is the full size of the image so just click as save preset or if you wanna create a per particular size you can save it and we create we save our preset and again go back to our image cache and see our new preset has been created and the next preset we have to make a thumb size so t h u m v thumb underscore image we create a thumb size image so here let's add a <coughs> resize and um, I just want to make it as 5 percentage 5 percentage height and 5 percentage width create action and you can see see our new <coughs> image preset which is thumb size um, and save that preset that's all we have to do here next again go back to administrator and let's create content uh, let's create a new content create content uh, called featured slider I just gonna create title called sample so okay or we can create as a slider one and you don't need to set menu and all and here you can see make sure you are selecting input format as full HTML here you can see here two extra fields has been created which we just created which is image field and link field so click on image field and go to your site and I mean go to your computer and upload any image so I'm just going to upload this image click upload and here you can give a link title and a link URL if you want I'm just going to give, leave it as it is if you wanna give you can give any link title like you know and a title will be added extra down and publishing options promote to front page publish just unclick promote to front page just click as published click save okay we need to create one more because it's a slider otherwise you can't feel so you just gonna create a slider two and browse one more image we just gonna upload now okay we have uploaded one more image and make sure input format is full HTML and link title you can set it up and publishing options just published not pub promote to front page <coughs> okay now we have created new content two contents and uh, next go to administer this step is a very important step from administer go to the views module 
the views module is a very important module and uh, it's very difficult to set up actually but if you do it properly you can do that very easily so from views click add button and create a new view then select the view name as the featured underscore slider because this is a machine readable name then view description as slider views then the view tag I just gonna give us a slide slide s l i d e slide then the view type make sure you select view type as node then click next and you get a big screen like this with lots of options don't be afraid we can set it up properly first we go to the field section the fields are very important for setting the field so you have a now we don't we didn't have we don't have any fields defined so we gonna define some fields here so from the right side you can see a plus mark and from here this is for adding the field so click on that plus mark and from the selection option click node this is like a filtering the different types of fields so now we just filtered out only the node fields so from here select node title make sure node title then click add button then we had another screen like this from here delete the label title then click update now we have successfully created our new field called title we have to create another field which is link again we click on the button and select node scroll down select node link make sure node link then click add button again delete the li label link then click update and now we have to create one more field the last one for image an image field so click on the button again now this time not the node but the content make sure content select content and click the first one content image then click add from here you don't need to do anything at the top just scroll down to the bottom then from the label section widget label select widget label then format as image make sure the format should be image image click update now you can see a view has been created this is a live preview this is a live preview of our nivo slider or the work we are going to, the thing which we are doing now you know if you haven't set up a uh, content or if you haven't created the content before setting up the view you can't get this live preview here so make sure that you have created a uh, content before setting the view settings otherwise you can't get the live preview here so it's always better to have a content before setting the views the next thing you have to set up is filters select node and node published so that only published node will be displayed in the featured slider so click add from here select yes published yes which means only published node will be displayed click update and next we have to create another another filter click add button again from here select node again this time node type node type select node type then click add we don't want any other type of node to be displayed in our content we want only our featured slider node to be displayed in our filter in our slider so select node type featured slider if you have lots of slider all the no I mean sorry if you have lots of node type all the node type will be displayed here 